Okay, so Davey has just finished up here at the clinic and he is now three weeks after having his kneecap dislocate. He's had an MRI scan which found a few things that we've got to keep an eye on, but he's still in really good nick. What I've done is progressed his exercise and in my blog post I've put together what the first stage of his rehab was and what we've progressed him on to now. So I hope you enjoy the videos. They're just a couple of exercises. Into part three, which is in another two weeks, David would have already gone and followed up with the orthopedic specialist to clear him to return back to running. So he'll be six weeks post knee injury. And so we've spent these, um, you know, he's spending this time from when he got injured up to week six in getting his body strong so that he's ready to get back up into running and uh, training for his rugby and rugby league and getting back to the guys down at Iron Armour um, to get him up into tip-top shape. Davey's done really well with his first three weeks of rehab. He's in this grey area where we want him to rest quite a bit to allow good healing, but we also want to start to get him working so we can get the strength back and support the knee. Basically, it's just a bum lift here, nice and easy, but the key things are he's emphasising the work by pushing on the inside of his foot so it targets the teardrop muscle, VMO, on the inside of the knee. Okay, so big muscles that are important is your backside. We really want the VMO and obviously your hamstrings. Okay, exercise number one, single leg bridge. Davey's gonna do a single leg squat. It's an eccentric squat. So he's gonna start, so I'll get you to do it straight away on the right leg. He's gonna really focus on lowering slowly. The slower, the better. Three to five seconds, that's it. And I really want him to try and make sure that he's lowering very slowly on almost like a seat. He's going down to seat height, just a touch higher, and we're trying to help him with the tendon underneath the kneecap. Okay, so single leg, quarter squat, good, one more. And there shouldn't be any pain or soreness same theme as he's lowering down, he's trying to think about the inside of the foot, trying to work this teardrop muscle. His crab walks with the band around his ankle, and he's going to hang on to the wall just for good support, and he's going to take a big step out to the side, and he's going to go in slowly, eccentrically, with the trailing leg. That's it. Big step out, in slowly. And as he gets stronger, he's not going to hold on to the wall. Okay, and he's going to see if he can just use the control on his hips. So come back towards me, David, please. A big step to the left. Try not to hang onto the wall. So squeeze your hip. Good. In slowly through the side. Perfect. So a good strength dosage is about three lots of ten. And I'd like him to try and complete that morning and night. And uh, we're going to see him in two weeks when he comes back after seeing the specialist. And we'll give you guys an update.